Gung Hei Bat Choi, here I am on the Great Wall of China. Ni Hao Cougars, Wo Zhao McKenna. Gung Hei Bat Choi, that means Happy Chinese New Year. It's Thursday, February 7th, and China is starting its celebration today of their new year. We are reporting to you from the Great Wall of China. Isn't it grand? The Great Wall of China is 4,000 miles long. It could stretch from Florida to the North Pole. It's hard to leave the wall, but we have more beauty straight ahead in the Cougar Art Museum. That was another great piece of Cougar Art on the Art Museum wall. We're back here on the Great Wall of China in celebration of the Chinese New Year. The Chinese New Year begins on the first day of the Chinese lunar calendar, which happens to fall on our calendar today. It's a great celebration of life and luck for the future. It's kind of like the way we celebrate our New Year and Christmas. It has lots of traditions and it lasts for 15 days. Did you know how old this great wall is? See if you can find the answer in spell check. Which of the words in green is misspelled? How old is the Great Wall of China? That's right, it's 2,000 years old and it's strong too. Hey Cougars, it's McKenna. The science fair is coming, but I think we should ask her about this. Come on, let's go. I'm here with Mrs. Bedford, the pro. Miss Bedford, when is the science fair? It's the third week in April. Do you have any do's and don'ts for the science fair? Do remember to turn all your parts of your science fair project in on time and don't forget to make sure that it is a science fair project and no models and no brand comparisons. Do you have any extra last tips? Um, just have fun doing it. Thanks for those tips. I know that they'll help me. This is Emily in Miss Rake's fifth grade class. Emily, what do you plan to do for the science fair? I plan to compare the blood pressure while playing two different Wii sports, which are going to be bowling and tennis. Do you have a hypothesis? I hypothesize that you will have a greater blood pressure while playing Wii tennis. That sounds really cool. Keep us posted. This is Nathan from Miss Rake's fifth grade class. Nathan, what is your purpose for your science fair project? Well, I'm going to see if the type of wingspan affects how far a plane can fly. That sounds interesting. Do you have a hypothesis? Yes, I predict that the plane with a larger wingspan will fly farther. You made science fun. Now I'm getting some ideas. I'm McKenna, signing off of CNN. This is an amazing law. But now it's time for you to say Zhang to China and Ni Hao to... I don't know what China's bug is, but I do know that this year is the year of the brown earth rat. The rat is considered to be foo. Foo is lucky. Here are some very foo AR scorecard winners. They made the AR 25 point club. It's Mrs. Skinner's class of readers. Meet Derek, Brianna, Gabby, Jasmine, Kayla, and Jacob. All made the 25 point club. What a team of readers. Score! That's great news! Congratulations to all of you! Miss Skinner has a great 25 point club in her room. Now here's a math moment. Bet you didn't know that lots of math went into making this famous wall. But did you know? Who said? An old Chinese proverb said, teachers open doors, you enter by yourself. The Chinese people honor their teachers, cougars do too. Right now, we'll go back to the studio for a few reminders for this week. You worked hard. You deserve it. Time to look on our lunch tray to see what's for. Hey, Cougars, I'm McKenna here to tell you about the Jogathon. Go for the gold. We are running laps. The Jogathon is an awesome way to raise money for your school. If you raise $25 or more, you automatically get a Go for the Gold t-shirt. Top money collectors will receive a $25 gift card. The top money collector will receive a $50 gift card. And the class that raises the most money all together gets an ice cream party. You'll be jogging on the PE court at your regular block time. So get on your running shoes, Cougars, because it's time to get your pledges and jog. I'm McKenna, jogging off of CNN.
Welcome to you Wednesday, February 6th, Cougars. Good morning, I'm McKenna with a warning about February. It's the shortest month of the year. Be smart, don't waste any of these days, okay? CNN is on for you. Let's go quick, let's go fast. Welcome to Cinnamon Roll. I knows that, that was quick. Now how fast can you meet me in? Alabama. I didn't see any ice cream in Alabama, did you? Me neither, but we know how to find ice cream. You just have to make ollies or all A's. Scream for ice cream if you made ollies or all A's. Can't wait to see you there. Oh, if you made your A-Argle, we will see you in your AR Choice shirt at the party. AR Choice shirt day is this Friday too. If the PTO is at the party, they might take our pictures and put them in the yearbook. Yearbooks, yearbooks. You may not get another chance to order a yearbook unless you do it now. PTO is taking your orders. Remember the good times at CCE, Cougars. Speaking of good times, it's time for... Lucky Raiders! Hey Cougars, God Spirit. This Friday, February 15th is Spirit Night at Chick-fil-A. Here are the top five reasons why you should eat at Chick-fil-A. Number five, you get to eat with your friends. Number four, your mom does not have to cook. Number three, you don't have to do the dishes. And number two, it's the best chicken in town. And the number one reason why you should eat at Chick-fil-A, it raises money for your school. See you then. Good morning, Cougars. I'm glad you are here on this Wednesday, January 16th. I'm McKenna. I have a lot to share with you today, so let's get started with some Cougar birthdays. Happy birthday. As we wish you all a very happy birthday, get ready to go to the birthday table for It Sounds Like a Party today. That makes me want to laugh out loud or giggle. Laugh, giggle. Words that mean the same thing are... Right! Synonyms! Watch! Welcome to Cinnamon Roll! Want to remember all your cool friends here at CCE? I know the perfect way. Buy a yearbook! Put One of my favorite memories at CCE is being a lucky reader. Let's see who is a lucky reader today. Welcome to Lucky Readers! Hope you were lucky today. If not, keep reading. Did you know that millions of years ago, Florida was an island? It's true. Florida Fun Facts are next. The carnival is coming. It's coming November 2nd. What can you do at the carnival? Eat. Cotton candy, ice cream, popcorn, lemon shakes, and pizza. Wait until you hear about all the new things at the carnival. What's new? The baseball toss. Pie in the face, tattoo parlor, and cool name bracelets. Don't forget the huge fun inflatables and don't forget the date, November 2nd. It's going to be some kind of fun. I'm McKenna. I'll see you at the carnival. Call Papa. Good morning, Cougars. I'm McKenna on the phone with Papa John's. Today is Thursday, January 24th. Call Papa John's tonight for a tasty school money-making treat. Thank you, Papa. I go to Cleveland Court Elementary School. That's all you have to do, Cougars. It's as pretty as a picture? No, wait. That's what we say when it's time for a CCE artist. Great artwork. Thanks for sharing your talent with us. Now, let's head on out to visit Mississippi. Roll on, Mississippi River. How do you spell Mississippi, Cougars? M I crooked letter, crooked letter, I crooked letter, crooked letter, I humpback, humpback, I. Very good, but can you find this spelling mistake? Spell check. Excellent spelling, Cougars. Let's move on from spelling to reading. It's a great day for the AR scorecard. Congratulations to you can get on the scorecard just like Emerson. All you have to do is keep reading and testing, and reading, and with practice, you can do it too. It's primary election day in Florida. Who will you vote for, Cougars? It's time to decide. Good morning, Cougars. Yes, it's January 29th. 
I'm McKenna. As you can see, I'm just outside the voting booth where we hope many Floridians will cast their decision for a presidential candidate. Be responsible and vote today, Cougars. It's a huge responsibility. Here it is, another responsibility. Pepper and P.E. is with us. Check it out. Now that's a pepper for you. Let's start up humming those homonyms. You know they sound the same but mean different things. Isn't it neat how every state has their own flower, bird, and tree? If you looked at your cougar calendar, you'd see that Thursday, January 31st is report card day. If you did your very best and you followed the school rules, nobody will be mad at you. Be responsible. It's the key. Wow, there's a vacuum cleaner in outer space. Here's NASA cats. Jump in Jupiter. Jupiter is a vacuum cleaner for the stars. I knew we were stars all along. Thanks, Jupiter, for the cleanup. And now it's time for you to decide. Who will you vote for for president? We have more news about our candidates. Let's get to know the people who are running for president before you cast your vote. Thank you for those important reports. It's time for your cougar weather. Democrats and Republicans. Democrats and Republicans. Republicans rule and Democrats are cool. And we get to vote at school. <laughs> Good luck voting today. Pick the best person for this very important job. The responsibility is yours, Cougars.